Luca's English game. Hey, Annie, on the Shimli Pia Rabun Chonun Yongguk Adishi and Midal. Hello and welcome to a new English PPT bomb game. And at the beginning of this game, there is this introduction slide. This particular game is based on the Disney animation movie Luca. I've named it the Luca English game. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Now, the next slide from here onwards will introduce about the point system. So, if this is the first time you're going to play this game, go ahead and explain about the points. However, I would like to go straight to the main game. So, I'm going to click on skip in the bottom right hand corner. There are 24 questions in this game. Um, there's some really great music. <laughs> old style Italian music and what I'm going to do I'm just going to come out of this and show you because this is a template so just for example here um, write in your question and write in your answer so we have a picture here of some apples if I line them up in the center there and I can make a question what's this or what are these with a question mark and then of course these are apples how many apples, three apples, make any question that you like, okay? So let me just go back to the main question slide again. And I'm gonna choose question number two. So now you've got the question, what are these? Go ahead and ask the question to the students, or the students can ask the questions to each other. And then that team of students should answer the question. What are these? These are apples. So using the space bar or the cursor to move forwards, and then we get some points. So this particular slide has uh, four points. And at the end of the slide, there's gonna be the, the Luca character is gonna come up in the right hand corner. So all you need to do is click on Luca and this will take you through to the points counter. So for example, team one, one, two, three, four, has four points and click on Luca in the middle and that's gonna take you back to the main question slide. Next, I'm gonna choose question number six. So as I said before, it's a template, question and uh, answer, and then click forwards. So this time we have the choice slide, uh, one, two, three, and four, <laughs> and that funky Italian music there. So in order to um, reveal the points that are there, just click on the color. Click on the color in the rectangular box, not on the character, but within the um, color part of the rectangular box. Click on that. So number one, for example, here, number one is the bomb. Number two is, okay, only one point there. Uh, number three on the red, we've got the change points. And then number four, Okay, cool. Number four is worth um, five points, I think. Yeah, that's five points there. Okay, good. So to go back to the points counter, simply click on the background. Click on the edge of the background. That would take you to the points counter. Yeah, whatever, whatever points they get in team two, you can put in there. You can go up to a total of 99 points. And then click on Luca to go back to the main question slide. Next one I'm going to choose is question number 10. Uh, question and uh, answer and then move forwards. So this one here is for extra points. Got a short animated GIF there. And then lots and lots and lots of points are going to come up. And there's going to be a total here of 10 points. Cool. To go back to the points counter, simply click on the background and put in the points. So if this was team three, they would have 10 points and click on the Luca character to go back to the main question slide. Let me choose number 11 next. Question and answer again and move forwards. So this is the change point slide. And yeah, the characters here, they change places. And then change points comes up and in the left hand side corner, top left hand side corner, uh, Luca's going to appear again. Simply click on the Luca character again and that's going to take you through to the uh, points counter.
and make up whatever points you want there. Click on Lucre in the middle to go back to the main question slide. So this is the final one we take a look at, uh, unlucky 13, uh, question and uh, answer. And this time, ow, we have the bomb. If this one gets uh, chosen, then uh, that team is gonna lose all their points. So I wrote in there, your team lose all points. Cool. To go back to the points counter again, just click on the background of the picture, background of the GIF, and then simply put in the points that you want there. So if they were team four, has got a bomb, you can put in zero there. Uh, or whichever team's got the bomb, team two. And then click on uh, Luca, the character, to go back to the main question slide. And that is it. I think it's around 80 to 90 megabytes, this um, game, so it's not too big. And um, it seems to be quite fun. I hope it can be useful to someone. And um, I will embed the font into this game. However, if it doesn't work, I'll also add a link to uh, this particular font that I use, which is called Abyss. So you can just go ahead and install that font very quickly if you need to. And that is it. I hope that you um, enjoy this game and I really hope that you have a wonderful week. And as always, enjoy your teaching and um, I'll see you again soon with some kind of new game or some kind of new something very soon. Take care. Ciao, ga. Bye bye.